We are deadlocked in an epic stand down. Stare down, not stand down, stare down. With a king air and some random person on the ramp. This is Kahului Vice. Except with less cocaine and more aircraft. You get the idea. Anyway, so hello everyone, it's Nader Gator, and today we're doing a uh, group flight with uh, my friend Kyron. You might remember him, me mentioning him anyways in uh, previous videos. And also a guy named John Optigrove, who's always been around the VATSIM community, always around the VATASIC community, he flies a lot, uh, knows a lot, uh, another X-Plane user. Uh, we are flying the Aerosoft slash McFat ATR-72500, uh, and the route as you can see from the blue bar is uh, Kahului to Waimea Kohala to Molokai to Hana to Lanai to Honolulu and then to Lihui. So far we've got three people on this flight. Ho uh, hopefully we'll get maybe one or two more people. I'm not quite sure. Uh, they're not quite ready yet. I just wanted to start the video, video a little early to give some uh, background. Um, but yeah, we're at Kahului right now, Maui. Uh, this airport scenery is provided by Naps, which is fantastic. It's freeware. It's awesome. It looks really, really good. Uh, as you can see, the custom model terminal here. Pan around. All the gates. This little cargo area over here. Parking. Runway's looking nice. And the uh, uh, GA area right here as well just a really really nice airport naps does a lot of hawaii scenery they have this airport uh, we'll see hana later on as well as uh, honolulu and lihui the uh, scenery for lanai molokai and waimei kohala is done by an independent developer i think i'm not sure if he's affiliated with naps or not but it also looks really really good so i can't wait to show off all the beautiful scenery and the beautiful islands as we fly uh pretty much the entirety of hawaii here But yeah, we're flying the Aerosoft McFat ATR-72500. Uh, in real life, uh, Island Air flies... I don't know if they fly the 72500 variant or a 300 variant. Or a 600 variant. Honestly, I don't know. I know they fly ATR, so... And Ohana, uh, Hawaiian, operated by Empire Airlines, also flies ATRs on the, some of the uh, less demanded routes. So I thought this would be an Whoa, appropriate plane to fly. Here? Hey John, uh, just so you know, I am recording so uh, for YouTube. So anything you say in here uh, will be on the recording. Just kind of—I mean, don't you don't have to be like squeaky clean or anything, but don't say anything incriminating. <laughs> Nathan buried the bodies. Uh, of course, that's what you go for. Okay, uh, you almost ready? Yeah, we have T uh, three today. Uh, they don't depart T three. Okay, I'm just completely unfamiliar with the ops here. Yeah, that's fine. Um, uh, I think when it's like 1304, it's really light, so uh, they're probably just using standard config, which is landing, departing 2, and then departing 5 on request. Okay, so taxi up to 2. Are you ready to go? Yeah, I'm pretty much I'm ready to go. I don't know about Kyron. He's muted right now, but... Anyways, we're flying the uh, Aerosoft ATR in the Island Air paint. Island Air is a real uh, airline. They used to fly a lot more routes in Hawaii. Now they just do Honolulu to Kahului and Honolulu to Lihui and back. Um, but we're going to be using them for all of these flights that we're doing. I just love the paint scheme for this. I love the aircraft. For every uh, for every study level sim, quote unquote, with all these systems working and buttons working and you have to do this, this, and this to get the plane to work right, I think this should be a plane that just looks good and is fun to fly. And this plane definitely fulfills that role very well. So let's go ahead. We already have the battery and all of the power turned on. We just need to start the engines and uh, get rolling here as soon as Kyron unmutes and is ready. Yeah, Kahului went 1304, altimeter 2993, so it's not really heavy enough to change from standard. 
All right, Karen, Ka Karen, you ready to go? The intro's done. Yes, the intro's done, and I'm ready to go. All right, I'm starting up. I want to be departing five, just because it's close and gives me a straight out departure kind of. But same here. All right, so to start, we already have uh, our generators, our uh, battery, our power. So let's go ahead, right. start A. If, uh, start A and B, I guess. But yeah, not all the buttons work. It's not really, it's not study level. Like I said, it's not uh, systems intensive, but it just looks good and it's just fun to fly. So I, I think for every, you know, uh, PMDG, there needs to be uh, uh, quality wings. I guess would be a close analogy. And did we get it? Oh, we hang on. Tch. Forgot kind of the crucial part of uh, starting. I need these two. There we go. Alright, let's. <laughs> that did not do anything. Alright, let's try that again. Do, 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 do. Alright, we should have it now. I got these for you. They have a cell phone pocket and a nice looking. I will go ahead and start number two. All right, so Nathan, you're ready for taxi? Yeah, I'm pretty much ready. Jesus, okay. Okay, well, I'm gonna slowly start moving. Alright, you go first. I'll go um, second. What? I'll go second. Okay. Uh, you're going off of runway 2, though, right? Yeah, intersection 2. I'm not sure which intersection it is. Let me just check. Uh, 2 from Foxtrot. Okay. Taxi light on, strobe light on, nav light on, seat oh, those are already on, okay. Uh, I think we have everything else. Yes, we do. Autopilot set, uh, <laughs> I accidentally pressed the altitude button before pressing altitude select. So, uh, 10,930 is uh, closest we're going to get to 11,000, which is our cruise today. Flying the Anohi 2 departure, which I'm going to hand fly for the 024 heading to 2100. And we're going to punch in the uh, heading That's select to 115. To, uh, to 7000 to intercept the uh, radial, the uh, Kahului, uh, or the Maui, I guess, uh, radial 085 to Anohi and then on to Barbie. Yeah, go ahead. Too late, I'm rolling anyway. I don't care. Good. Have you inside of all you have? Alrighty. Thank you. Yeah, John, you can go and then I'll go after you, alright? So we're going to be number three for the. Uh, number two off of runway five, but number three overall for departure here. I'm gonna wait on John Optigrove to go after Kyron here. There's Opt. He got off quick. Alright, he's clear, Ky Kyron's clear. We don't really care about separation. I'm just gonna show who's online real quick, just in case any ATC does come online. And let's get out of here.
you're up. Climbing out on a heading of zero two four. Zero two four two three two four. Close enough. All the way through two thousand one hundred. Go ahead and retract the flaps. If we had, I don't actually think I put down flaps with team, but oh well. It's 024 heading here. Go through 1000. Heading select. Alright, we're coming through 2100, so let's go ahead and turn autopilot on. User disconnected from your channel. channel. It's gonna turn us to a 115, uh, yeah, 115 heading to intercept the 085 radio. Flying through some clouds here. See right here as that move towards zero a five will start turning. Let's go ahead and start now actually. Zero eight five. Oh, we we're close enough. Zero eight five right oh that's actually that's pretty much right on the money. I think we did pretty good there. Alright, 08520 Nohi, and then Barbie thereafter. Climb through 5,500. We got mountains off to our right side here. Maui's a beautiful island. One of the airports in this, in this uh, group hops that we're coming back to is actually going to be coming up here on our right side. Okay, thank you. Hey, a bunch of people got in this channel, Jesus. Let's go ahead and actually put this thing on LNAV. Uh, we need. Oh, here we go. Let's go. FMS. There we go. Alright, LNAV. Not. <sighs> Thought I had this thing on. Uh... That's weird. Um. I turn this thing to FMS. FMS, 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 FMS. No. Uh, hmm. Well, anything else I can do here? 
Doesn't look like it. You guys know why this isn't working to go to uh, LNAV? Let me know in the comments, whoever's watching this. I think I'm just being an idiot and forgetting something, but I thought if I turned this to FMS, it would go to do that. Maybe I had to do it before I took off. Yeah, so go ahead and change the... Uh, there we go, that heading seems about right. User left your channel. User left your channel. No, oh, now everybody's leaving. <laughs> Got up the grove right in front of me and Chiron leading the pack. You guys need to speed up. I'm doing uh, 250 right now. Oh well, yeah, well, that's a cool story, bro. Very much fast. Oh wait, yeah, I can. Uh... Well, I guess we don't have enough for us. Yeah, we have my throttle at eighty percent. I do. Through ten thousand. Oh, we didn't turn our light on. Of course, we didn't. Ah. Uh, anyway, strobe off. Yeah, I think we're good. It's speed's dropping a little bit, but we're almost that cruise, so I'm not really worried about it. At 11,000 now. We're gonna really gas this thing to uh, catch up with Opta Grove and Chiron. There's a Nohi, there's Barbie right in front of us. We're gonna turn right afterwards for towards uh, Upulu Point VR. Do you mind not hitting my desk, please? Do you mind not hitting my desk, please? Thanks. Anyways, start turning right here over Barbie. Let's go. Let's see what this heading does for us. Uh, one, f well, one four eight. Let's try one five zero. Uh, I might need one six zero or one six. Uh, let's try one sixty. And one sixty four should work. Alright, so direct, uh, actually we're not direct to Pula Point, we are, uh, direct to Limburg, around the Victor 11, going to Upulu Point. Yeah, Limburg, Pulps, and then Upulu Point, on the Victor 1-1. Go ahead and get an outside view real quick. User disconnected from your channel. That looks nice. I like it. 
Only thing I have, only thing I kind of have a beef with with the outside of this aircraft is that the uh, the props aren't really animated that well. Kind of just stay in one motion and yeah. That's minor. I totally messed up on my radio tracking. Of course you did. Yeah. To be fair, I'd probably mess up too if I was actually doing that still. This is what happens when you are trying to. Are you already on? Are you already? Are you already past the Pulu point? Yeah. Both of you are. Jesus. Anyways, there's Hana right here. It's the airport we're going to after uh, after two flights from now. It's a nice little airport on the east coast there. Possibly Short runway, on, nice approach. Uh, 26 miles from it. Yeah, I'm coming up to 27 and a half miles from it. Okay, I thought you guys were already there. <laughs> <laughs> Karen, I don't know where you're going, but... Uh, yeah, um, not that slow. <laughs> what? Shit. Shit. My ball sack. My engines are dead. They just got killed. <gasps> no! How? How are you that bad at flying that? No, 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 no. So, I guess if... Oh, my God. Everything's off. Com okay, uh... Do you even know how to airplane? Yes, I know how to airplane. Hey, I was. Okay, I, my torque was over the red. Excuses. Line. Excuses. My torque was over the red line. Oh, there's your problem. You don't know how to airplane. No, 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 no. John yes. said to stay over 250, and I was starting to stay over 250. So you don't kill your plane while doing that. But I didn't think I was going to kill it. I wasn't that much over. Even though it was in the red. <laughs> even though it was in the red. <laughs> <laughs> well, mechanic, sorry, I, uh, I kept my car on a red line for, uh, <laughs> for five minutes, because I was told to keep the speed limit of 100 miles an hour, or 60 or whatever, but I had to do it in second gear, and I didn't think it would break the engine. <laughs> Karen, you could have just told us to slow down like a big boy, but... Like a big boy, yeah. I'm yeah. yeah. That's ever gonna happen. Uh. <coughs> ah. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Uh oh. Just watch out for the idiot diving into the ocean on your left hand side. <laughs> <laughs> So, lesson learned from that one, right? I'm gonna try and see if I can actually glide it into uh, the airport. Oh You're my gonna gosh. About a 270 degree turn to your right, and uh. Yeah, 270 to your right, and then there's an airport right there, which is your nearest field, I think. Screw that. Hana. I'm going this way. I'm going this way. We're going to Hana later on. We're gonna do, uh. Uh, Waimea Kohala, which is where we're going right now, to Molokai, and then Molokai to Hana, and then Hana to Lanai, and so on. You know, I don't even care. I'm not even going to land on room 4. I'm landing on 2-2. That's a cool story. It is. It's a very cool story. Because I don't even know where I'm going. Of course you don't. Of course I don't. I don't. Almost over pulps here. FAA accident report, July 18th, 2016. Uh, Beechcraft King Air Registration November 629 or Julia Golf crashed into the ocean after <laughs> the pilot assumed that he could glide to. <laughs> pilot, was, pilot was peer pressured into redlining his engine. <laughs> Another human factors accident.
kind of cloudy, so you don't really get to see the uh, island quite yet. Which kind of sucks. Don't worry, I think I, I think I can do this. I'm at 6,000 feet and about 18 miles out. I can do this. I thought I'd be doing a little bit better over the ground in 255, but oh well. Also, Kyron, you are most definitely more than 18 miles out. Okay, fine, I'm 18 and a half. <laughs> Try like 25. Uh, wrong. If I'm 25, I'll say you're only doing 92 over the ground. <laughs> Okay, guys, I'm gonna make a stop in Upalo. You mean Upulu? Upulu, however you say it. Or Upalu, whatever. I don't, I don't, I don't know. know. I don't care how you say it right now. <laughs> is there an airport there? I honestly don't remember. Yeah, there is. There is, actually. Oh, uh, okay. I <laughs> see you guys right over my head. Oh yeah, P H U P. <laughs> yep. Runways thirty eight hundred by seventy five, go for it. Oh boy. Oh man. Nah, it'll be fine. Thanks for making me worry. Yeah, I'll be fine, I'll be fine. It's a community night. Aircraft operations 98 a week, and 59% of those are military, so. Oh, okay. 2% local general aviation, because there's only one aircraft based on the field. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Nathan, you're distracting me. Don't distract me. Well, you distracted yourself when you. Never mind. Shut up. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and start descending here. Uh, let's go down to 5,000. I guess it'll be 4,930, but altitude select. Vertical speed. Oh, that, that way. There we go. Kyron. <laughs> Mayday. Oh, we got a turn. Oh, not that much though. There we go. Anyways, we're direct Jason now, and Jason will take us right on the VOR DME approach. Let's see, VOR DME runway 4, off of Jason. So we've got to be uh, Jason at 4,300. Jason at 4,300 if you're flying a VOR DME approach. I was going to kind of short take visual. Um, probably about a three mile final, I think. Solid. I don't understand this. I'm 1,500 feet above the ocean and I'm a mile from the airport. Not gonna make it. Not gonna make it, yep. 
Ditch, ditch, ditch. <laughs> Made it. Turn the ELT on. <laughs> one to one point five. One to one point five. You're on guard. Going down and made it. Made it. We gotta uh, do sort of post on next flight. Just go ahead and do a a rescue operation of Sea Kings. Let's see if we can see the airport yet. Somewhere out here. On the big island now. Kona's over here ish. And then Hilo's way over there on the east side. Turning base for my four. Oh, good for you. Roger. Good for you on 500 feet. Of you're you're turning know? base for uh, the ocean. You're correct, I am. Actually, and you better believe he's proud of it. <laughs> <laughs> this is above all my other things. Oh, man. John, I'll come in behind you. Uh, yeah, post that on YouTube and see how many angry comments you get over your incompetence. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. <laughs> 10 out of 10 would do again. Great fish bait. Uh, great, great fish. Great fish bait made. I rate 8 out of 8. 50, 40, 30. 20, 10, uh. Oh, it was actually a pretty smooth landing. Retard, retard, retard. In more ways than one. <laughs> Good for you, question mark? Yeah, cookie? <laughs> yes, cookie. Field I'm literally floating in the ocean. Cool story. No flop landing because I can. Hashtag you can't tell me what to do. <laughs> Hashtag my airplane is now upside down in the ocean. Hashtag no one cares because you're being an idiot and you deserve it. Hashtag I know I kind of deserve it, but still. <laughs> At the same time, this isn't right. Just pilot things, getting peer pressured into redlining your engines. <laughs> it's like pilot high school. All of the alpha bitch girl is uh, <laughs> the pressure of getting redlining his engines. <laughs> That's one way to put it. How'd that happen? How'd that happen? Kyron got peer pressured into redlining his engines. I did. Oh, it's all because of you guys. It's all because of Oh, sure. Blame it on us. I will blame it on you, Nathan and John. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and bypass Jason and go to whatever this next one is on the VOR DME. It's really just gonna be a visual. I don't even have the VOR tuned in, but gotta have some kind of a track. Let's see if we can see the airport. Should be right. Oh, there we go. Uh, Wait. Know, that's the only YouTube video I'm doing for this month. Right over here. You get shamed into never making a YouTube video again. <laughs> send me a link. Yeah, send me a link when you upload it. My god, that was so just... Ugh. Come on, where are you guys at? I'm at... Kahula? Uh... Koala, yeah, koala. You're in the middle of the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> I am Roast. koala, and I see you guys on fire. No, you just spawned in right there. No, no, I landed True. at koala. Hashtag take off where you land. <laughs> I landed at koala. Senior's not too bad. There's a transporter accident. There's the airport.
Alright, we're just gonna visual this baby. This thing's actually pretty fun to hand fly, I'm not gonna lie. I don't care about the autopilot being off. Let's go ahead and zoom out a little bit. Alright, so we got our gear down. 3 green, flaps 15. Let's go flaps 30. Got up the Grove landing right now. Call when you're clear, John. Clear in five, four, three, two, one, clear. Nice. Yes, yeah, flight in the real world, uh, Kahului to Waimea Kohal is done by Moku Lele Airlines, who flies Cessna 208s on these kind of routes. And apparently, I have the hiccups. Switch PC12. Alrighty. Man, you really gotta push the nose down on this thing to get it to descend. Oh god, I have a headache now. Lol. <laughs> One flight end when you're already having problems. <laughs> High coming down now. Speed of 160. Let's pull that back to, or just try to pull it back anyways to 140. Ish. We're gonna land around 120. Coming down. Hey, yeah, yeah, sink rate. Was a bouncer. Jesus. Well, we're on the ground. <laughs> Versus. That was not a good landing at all. <laughs> I think my landing was even better. Bounced it a little bit. <laughs> Came in a little fast, a little bit high. It's all good though. These people flying these commuter airlines don't expect too much. <laughs> How hard was your ditch into the sea? Uh, 500 feet front No, actually it was. Alright, uh, let's go and taxi back here using the turnaround bay. I flared epically. So did you say you failed epically? I flared epically. Go ahead and take the flaps out. Failed, I, had about, I had about 25 pitch up. We forgot to use uh, landing lights again, didn't we? Dang it. I, I always forget about that unless it's nighttime. And hey, who's this? Gonna do a fast backtrack on this runway here. Alrighty. Next flight's from Waimea Kohala to Molokai. Well, hopefully on our next flight the landing will be a little bit better because that was that was rough. Actually, my last few landings really haven't been that great. I need a uh, I need a greaser. I'm due for one. I'm due for a greaser. And it was here at White Mako Hollow with some nice freeware scenery. I think this is a sole developer. I don't think Naps does this, but see their airport name on the custom terminal. All right, there we are. Parking brake. And shut it down.
I want to do this as a part of six videos, so this is part one, uh, stay tuned for part two.